boys. I just woke up and saw that we've got new update leaks in the strongest battlegrounds, and this is crazy. These leaks come from the official owner of the game, and my gosh, guys, this next update is going to be crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, you know how there's going to be a boss coming in this next update? If you don't, you haven't seen my other videos. Go check them out or subscribe so you get notified. But basically, there's a boss coming in this update, and up till now, we really only had like a tiny leak for it, but it really wasn't anything big until today, boys, because officially we have an actual like we have footage of this boss. We have more than just a little picture of the head. So let me go ahead and show you guys. So as you can see right here, you know, a, a couple days ago, we got this leak of the crab's head and, you know, I made a whole video on this. Pretty cool. Pretty cool leak. I, I like it a lot. It looks really cool. You can see there's four eyes, very spiky. Then after that, we got the third awakening move leaked, which, you know, obviously looks just absolutely insane. Just look at this, bro. This move is wild and this is also going to be coming in the next update. So can't wait to see this. But then ladies and gentlemen, right here, if we keep scrolling down, as you can see today, oh, never mind. yesterday, actually, I'm a day late to this. Golly. Okay. Well, my bad guys, as you can see yesterday at 3 6 PM, we got this leak right here, guys. Okay. But wait, 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 wait. This is not the only leak. This is just the one that I'm going to show you real quick. And then we are going to move on to another one right here from Santino. So guys, as you can see, this is for, I'm assuming an impact frame, which tells me that they're working on more ultimate moves for Suryu. Once again, guys, tell me how you say Suryu in the comments. In my last video, I said for you guys to tell me how to pronounce it. And the sheer amount of comments that I got that were contradicting each other was hilarious. So comment on this one, how you say it. And then I'll take the most commonly said options and put them on a community poll. And you guys can vote up which one is the correct way to say it. Anyways, sorry, I'm getting distracted. So yeah, this is going to be a impact frame for martial artist for the ultimate. So I'm really excited to get that. But yeah, guys, without further ado, what you actually clicked on this video for the boss leaks. So let's scroll down. And as you can see right here, guys, bada bang, bada boom, the owner has released some footage of the boss. So let me go ahead and read to you what he said about this before we uh, get into it. So he pinged at sneak peeks. And then if we keep scrolling down, he said, you'll be able to play as the boss after beating it like a juggernaut type of thing. It's not going to be on the character list. So, oh my gosh, guys, this is actually going to be a playable character if you beat the boss. This is going to be awesome. Okay. All right, guys. So without further ado, let me go ahead and show you guys the footage here. So uh, you know what? I'm just going to let you guys see it. Boom. So yeah, as you can see, basically the crab arm rises up out of the ground and then it hits the ground. And as you can see, if you look at the very end of this clip, there's some eyes that are rising up. So yeah, guys, this is how the boss is going to rise out of the ground. And my my gosh, these animations look good. Look at the grin on Santino's face. He's excited to get this added to the game. By the way, guys, if you don't already know, Santino is the owner of the game, aka the Saint 111, aka the guy with like 2000 usernames, aka this guy right here. And yeah, as you can see, he's cooking up a crazy boss. So I can't wait to see what they do with this. And so, yeah, wait, let's talk a little bit more about how this is going to work. You'll be able to play as the boss after beating it. So is one of the players in the server always going to be the boss? How does that work? Okay, I, I, that's a little bit confusing. Not entirely sure how that's supposed to work. I mean, yeah, no, no, no clue. Guys, tell me how you guys think this is going to work right here. Juggernaut type of thing. I don't know. Maybe it's like it randomly selects a player who's beaten it at least one time. So that way, whoever's playing it knows how it's supposed to work. I don't know. All that I know is that this update is going to be absolutely fire. And I'm going to keep you guys updated on everything that's happening with it. So guys, keep watching to find out. Now, guys, I do also also just quickly want to go through uh Suryu's update what's all what all is coming in the next update for Suryu and all the other things that we know so without further ado let's go ahead and do that bro so starting off with this leak right here I don't know if this has been added to the game yet so let's go ahead and see so yeah guys as you can see this is a special interaction right here between sewer 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 Ryu yeah that's definitely how you say that and Garu so yeah I mean as you can see pretty cool special interaction as far as I'm aware this hasn't been added to the game yet, but tell me if I'm wrong. And then next up right here, this is where all the summer update leaks started. We got a picture of a crab with this crazy map leak behind it. So as you can see, there's palm trees and a beach and 
you know, there's chairs back there and water. It's pretty cool. Kind of crazy. I like it. And if we look at the direction that the shadows are facing here, and we look at how the shadows face in the strongest battlegrounds, then we can be pretty certain that this map expansion is going to be like right here. As you can see, shadow on the ground, same shadow on the ground right here. So by the looks of things, the map is going to open up right here and we're going to see a crazy new map for this event, which is pretty exciting. We've been waiting a long time for something like this to get added to the game. And then of course we got these leaks that I already told you guys about, but there's a bunch of leaks that I haven't shared with you yet that were private. These leaks were sent to the content creators by the owner of the game, only to the content creators. And you can only find them if you're looking for them. But of course, your boy Zebra is always looking for them. So as you can see right here, Santino said right now there's a timer for a live event, but I don't know what else to add. So guys, we know that somewhere in the map, there's going to be a big old countdown and you know, that's, that's basically it, but it's going to be counting down to when this event starts, which is pretty exciting. But then the owner said this, he got some new ideas and basically said he's going to be adding beach sand that has destruction, volleyballs, giant boss timer, and tsunami random event. Okay, hang on. Let's break this down one by one. So Beach sand has destruction. Okay, so basically, you know that game, that Battlegrounds game that like whenever you hit someone or, or do something, it breaks the ground around you and it actually has like full out destruction physics. Well, guys, that's coming to the strongest Battlegrounds and it's going to be crazy. So stick around for that because it's going to look so cool. Oh, and also not to mention the walls are going to be destructible too soon. Let me see if I can find footage of that. So yeah, as you can see right here, the owner posted a poll and 95% of people said that the wall walls should be destructible. And then as you can see, released on Jeff's YouTube channel, which Jeff is one of the testers for the strongest battlegrounds, we got this right here. So as you can see, he's using uh, the, the s s strongest punch, whatever this is, serious punch. Yeah, you guys know what I mean. And as you can see, he absolutely decimates this wall, guys. So this is also coming in a soon to be update. Oh, yo, what's this? Wait, I don't even think I've seen this yet. Oh, yo, that's sick. Okay, so you can also melt the walls too. Oh, yo, yo, what? Yo, that looks crazy, bro. Yo, okay. So yeah, guys, this is coming in a very soon update. Don't worry. Maybe even in this one. But anyways, moving on to bigger and better things. Beach sand has destruction. Volleyballs. So I'm assuming that these volleyballs can be used as like weapons and stuff. Maybe you can pick them up like trash cans. I don't know. We'll have to see. That would be cool if they did that though. Giant boss timer. So I'm assuming that this will be the countdown to when the boss spawns next. Can't be really too sure on the wording of this, but still sounds pretty pretty sick. And then treasure hunt cosmetics. So basically what you'll be able to do is there's going to be chests around the map and they'll be pretty rare to find. And when you find one, you get a cosmetic. And I'm pretty sure these cosmetics carry with you throughout like the end of the event too. So once the event's done, you keep the cosmetic. It would be super cool. And it's going to be super cool whenever it finally comes out. Now, how many cosmetics are we going to be getting? Well, the owner has confirmed that there's going to be six cosmetics as well. And they're going to be cool. They're going to be like animated and stuff. So so stick around for that because that's going to be awesome. I'm definitely going to be trying my best to get all six of these and I'm 100% going to be live getting them. So I don't know, subscribe so you don't miss it. Anyways, guys, I'm pretty sure that that's about everything for all the leaks. So yeah, guys, let me know what you think of all of this in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you again very soon. Peace.